Uh, this extra research slot's gonna take us 70 days, but it'll totally be worth it. Because we literally only have two. Um, we're actually doing pretty well, I think. Uh, our Communist Party's at 62%, so that's nice. Um, we're getting Soviet, so Soviet diplomats and everything. But, um, anyway, I just checked on the French, but, um... Our armies are... These guys are what? These guys are regulars. Have these guys... They're almost there. These divisions are, um... Almost. And then once they get to... Yeah, it gives a 25%. Yeah, so... I mean, I assume that these guys are not regulars. Are they defending? Do we have the forts up yet? I'm just kind of curious. Oh, we should have military factories open, shouldn't we? Oh, no. Did I, like, preset some into... Oh, yeah, we're making uh, inner war fighters. I would actually rather us make close air support. Instead. Yeah, there we go. Uh, we're making 11 a year. Great. The... Can we build another factory, please? Uh, military, maybe? Uh, here, shift click it, I think, goes to the top, right? Yep. Alright, there you go. Oh, we actually have a resource deficiency. Uh, steel. Alright, well, let's trade with Kami France. For three civilian factories. So we should be good there. This is why we need to seize the Paraguayan... St oh, wait, no, those factories. Actually, no, that showed it anyway. This is why we need to seize the Paraguayan steel. And they have some tungsten as well, so we can start building, like, tanks and whatnot. Um, so, France is communist now, uh, if you guys were wondering. Um, and they're still being boosted, actually. I haven't stopped boosting them yet. But this is good, because if you click on France, and you go to the political thing... They're actually in the common turn now. So now we now we have like an ally in Europe. Jesus, there's a lot of resources in Europe. But we have a lot of rubber. So I think if we can research um, motorized... I, I can't remember exactly where it is. Uh, we're still making support one. Yeah, motorized. It's down here. Oh, we can get artillery? Huh. Yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start researching motorized uh, next when I, like, get that extra research slot. Which will be done in, like, a day or two. And then... Oh, we're almost 100% communist. And then we'll be able to go and do stuff. That's super close to being done, actually. Oh, I haven't been keeping track of the date. Paraguayan communism failing. Alright, let's try and get the... Uh, can we go for... Secret weapons... What if I just go for nuclear effort? 50% reduced penalty. I don't think I'm going to make nukes. I'm just saying. Okay, uh, we got a free research slot now as well. Alright, let's get motorized. And because we have the oil, um, it should be good. Alright, nice. We got seven divisions. They're being, um, they're going to come out soon. I mean, we're doing better than the British Raws. Um, we're oh my god. Okay, I was really scared there. I thought all of my divisions had disappeared for a second. Alright, so he is almost trained. He's at 82%. And then when he's done, I'll just stop training them all. I don't think these need to... These guys need to get trained. We probably have a deficiency now from... Oh, no, we actually don't. Eventually, what we'll do is we'll switch to military equipment 3. Oh, we can modify the government... Uh, I don't think I really need a backroom backstabber. Because it's like f plus 5%. And I'm just sitting here. It's not like I really need to start declaring war on country. I'll just save it up, honestly. I mean, these guys, I think they know I'm justifying on them. And every single division that comes out now, I'm going to make it so that they have to be trained like properly. So they're not just a crappy, like, green level... And these guys have, like, really bad organization as well. So once they stop training, you know. 
but they have a really good plan preparation. So we got a 50% attack bonus, and we've also got a 25% attack bonus because we've been training them, so. Oh, and we can actually, um, we, we can refit these. Okay, our combat width is 16. Uh, what is it now with the remove? Okay, uh, what if we just add in artillery? Combat with 19, and then if we add in, what, how much is that? Um, actually, nah, I'm not, I'm not gonna do it yet. I'll wait till I have a bit more experience. It's a good thing, though, that Brazil has, like, all of this. All right, we can stop training now. Oh, yeah, the organization just soars back up. Only four months till the first war. Oh, we don't need to execute aggressively yet. Uh, how much close air support will we have by then? We currently have three units. Okay, uh, how are those military factories going? This is almost done. All right, next next thing goes into close air support because I don't think these guys have any planes whatsoever. Uh, actually, how is the Brazilian Navy? Where are we deploying from? Rio de Janeiro, and it's... It's okay. It's not amazing. We got like skill level three. Can we make anything? We're making one convoy. Actually, we could probably just build some docks, couldn't we? All right, so that's, that's, oh wait, actually, no, that takes away from, I can't build there if I have a dock. Never mind. Oh, okay, for some reason our national focuses are like just doing each other I don't know um so let's see we can actually can we join the common turn yet oh we finished excavation one I'm trying to make our resources more efficient here is this still ahead all right all right we got a free military factory I'm gonna look at that one a week two factory oh well could get two week actually. Yeah, look at that one one plane a week now. Great. All right. Um, can we build some more military factories? Maybe. We gotta slowly build a military factory. Actually, how many civilian factories do we have? I don't know if we need them all. I'm just gonna continually keep uh, emphasizing on military because that's that's the more important one. Actually, let's just finish that factory first. Oh, something else finished? Uh, Alright, I'm trying to make our resource gains more efficient. Can we join the common turn yet? Just out of question. And the answer is... X to join faction. They will say yes. Hey, we did it! We're in the common turn. We stand together. So what are they doing? Like, I want to see what the Soviets are doing right now. All right, so it looks like they're actually going to do the Winter War with um, with Finland. They're going to take this state off of Finland and, like, I think this one in the north right here and this one? I can't tell. Usually the Soviets just invade Finland because, you know, they're the Soviets. Actually, here, what are they going for right now? Oh, Stalin's still doing the Great Perch. Uh, wow. Let's see. Great Purge. It, it's under the Permanent Revolution, right? I'm trying to click. Uh, I don't get to see what it does. So, yeah. Oh, wait, no. If I just hover over it, it'll show me. Uh, Trotsky gets a better leader trait. And then this assassinates Trotsky. All right, all right. So now we have uh, the common turn. Look at that. We got the Brazilian Socialist Republic, the French Commune, Mongolia, Tanatuva, and the Soviet Union. Um, who is the most powerful faction? Oh, it's Oceania. Whoops. What if you just put all of the? Uh, this just turns all the countries on. So this is 
communist. So there's no communist people in North America yet. There is one communist nation. Oh, I didn't wait. Paraguay is communist. I didn't even know Paraguay was communist. Since when are they communists? Hold on. What? Huh? I don't know if I want to justify these guys now. Oh yeah, they're super communist. Oh, at least they're not in the faction. Oh, actually, the justification. Yeah, it just finished. All right, let's do it. Uh, hold on. Uh, just quick. Can we deploy these divisions? All right, let's just uh, deploy them and have them on standby just in case. Uh, over here. All right, we're going to set the plan in motion. And let's do it. Let's declare war. Alright, uh, we are sort of winning. Yeah, we're winning. The Soviet Union wants to help. Sure, I'll, let the, I'll, I'll say yes to that. Oh, wow, we are not winning these fights. Okay, thank you, Soviet Union. Alright. Okay, okay. Alright, uh... Uh, air superiority. Also, I think we have some close air support. Yeah, we do. Uh, we're going to deploy it from... Oh, whoops. Uh, give it the mission. Uh, all right, it's not even... It hasn't deployed yet. All right, well... Um... This is working out pretty well for us, I think. Are we going to take their capital? Yeah, in four days we'll take their capital. Alright, um... The heck? Do we have air superiority over all of South America? There are actually eight enemy planes in the area? Oh, and we did it. That was easy. Uh, enter. And the Soviet Union actually had participation in that. Look at that. And we did it. Brazil has expanded a great deal. Oh, we got some military factories now. Alright, let's put some more into close air support. And then we'll, we'll add, um, a, we'll, we'll actually build some more fighters. Alright, we're making one plane a year. Great. Uh, yeah, look at that. So, uh, next on the list is the rest of the world. And I'll give you guys an army as well. So these guys are going to get a front line down here. On this country. They're probably gearing up now because they've seen what happened. Um, we're also going to exercise these guys as well. Oh, these guys are uh, experience level green, but they're lucky. And then these are my seasoned guys, right? Yeah. All right. We'll take them down here as well. Do we have a land? Uh, yeah, actually, you know what? We'll take them down here as well. We'll give them an offensive line into, oh, I got to draw a front line first. And then we'll give these guys, like, a direct push into, um, just right here. So we'll have two armies pushing in. This should be pretty good. Um, and we're a bit low on fighters. We probably got, a, probably a couple of them got shot down, honestly. Um, but yeah, first successful military campaign. Argentina does have this stupid, like... Oh, we have an airbase now uh, over where Argentina would be. I think we actually captured some planes as well. That or all of our um, fighter pilots... Or, or all of our fighters got shot down. Uh, no, actually, we didn't. Alright. Alright, these guys can go back to... Uh... Uh, we'll just put these... 
the guys there. Um, I don't know. I don't think the Brazilian Air Force did too much in that one, really. Uh, what are these guys doing? These guys are still forming the front over here, and these guys are in training, but they're also going to form the front. So, how long till... Uh, Alright, it's almost done. 55 days. What I want to do is I want to plan a little bit of a naval invasion. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to give this guy... Oh, whoops. Alright, so, um... Oh, nice. Hindenburg incident. Great. Amazing. Beautiful. Um... I don't know if it's a better idea to try and paratrooper in, or if it's a better idea just to do, um, like a naval. Because we're making one close air support a week, and we're making a ton of infantry one equipment. Like, I don't think I'm going to need to change that over to, like, at least 1940. Uh, I don't know what I want to spend it on. Maybe fighter planes? Uh, interwar fighter. Seven a year. Great. That's not an atrocious rate at all. And um, we got a new national focus of doing... Alright, I'll do one more in the armament. And then once we're done with that tree, we'll be pretty set. This is a pretty big army, actually, that we're going to be invading with. So, what I'll do is I'll set this guy in with a new general. Actually, how close are these guys? You know what? Um, cancel. I'll have him train. Um, and hopefully, he'll train up moderately quickly. But, um, yeah, well, we have an air base over... Yeah, we do. Okay. Hopefully. What's the kind of regions here? So this is... Terrain is... Rain. Alright. Terrain is rain. So it's all just plains, plain, plains. Problem is their capital is in the south, so... I don't, I don't know how this is gonna go. But, um, we are still training up our armies, so... So these guys are the fresh guys, and these guys, all right, these, oh, these guys aren't training? They should be. Everybody should be training, like, just no one should be. Available planes in reserve. I, I am good, thank you. It's nice, you know, it's, it's, you know, like, like, it kind of spoil, it's kind of being spoiled playing as a larger country. Because when you do it, it's like, oh, okay, I'm a larger country now, like, you know, whatever. Uh, I might be able to do a naval invasion, actually, from, um, yeah, if I can get a port right here, I might navally invade back here, bring in my army, and then, um, freak them out, push down through the north, I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, everybody's attritioned, but, uh, I don't know, maybe they have 12 divisions at most. Alright, so we just finished motorization effort and motorized. So I'm immediately going to start training ourselves some motorized divisions. Um, where do we want them to come out? Probably in uh, this area. And we'll add, like, maybe three units. And then those will just be deployed whenever, I guess. I think I also might research light tanks. It seems like a good idea. Oh, Amelia Earhart did not die, which is surprising. She does usually die. I haven't even gotten off a of volunteer only, right? Uh, oh, am I? Oh, I'm unlimited. Uh, population 1.5% popul- Alright, I'm on limited conscription. That's not great. Um. Mm, man, this is gonna be- This- The manpower is gonna be an issue, I think. Definitely. Alright, so we've almost got the um, the newest army, which is like the... What's this guy good at? Oh, he's actually really good at attacking. What's this guy good at? Uh, jungle attacking. What's this guy good at? So, I went to go have a drink. Just got back. The Marco Polo bridge incident happened. Um... The leadership purges in the Soviet Union, and we completed Armament 3, which is, you know, nice. Um, 
We might as well go for it. We got some more free military factories. How many paratrooper planes are we making? Just out of question. Uh, I don't have paratrooper divisions researched either. We're making two a year. I feel like that's kind of a waste of a military factory, honestly. How many do we have right now? Transfer. We haven't even made one yet. Why am I over Argentina? All right, so let's see. Is the are this is this army trained up yet? All right, so they're finishing now. Um, this guy's almost finished. And these guys are gonna take a long time to train. I want to get them to experience level three, and this guy doesn't have any orders assigned. Uh, all right, there he goes. So okay, he's on like the other side. That was weird, and we are uh, justifying on Uruguay, by the way. If you were, oh, they're doing a bomber focus. They're gonna try and bomb my infrastructure. All right, we gotta, we gotta pump everything into planes. We gotta shoot their bombers down. Uh, infrastructure. Uh, here we go. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Also, how is the training going? All right, we're gonna have three motorized divisions soon. And our infantry is sort of starting to come along now. All right, good. We'll have three military factory. This one will be done in a little while, actually. This will be done August 14th. Yeah, it'll be done in like a couple of days, pretty much. So just finished. Um, yeah, I'm just going to keep putting stuff into inner war fighters. Because uh, we just, I think we need more planes. Like right now, our infantry equipment one is like, perfect 83 a day that's pretty good and we're making two support equipment in fact we actually have enough now to uh uh fix the division if we just put in an artillery and then two artillery oh uh 22 what if we do that okay hold on uh remove that if it's support artillery, so can we just, um, uh, back, uh, ah, oh, man, that sucks. All right, you know what? We'll wait, we'll wait, uh, so we can get the three rows, uh, till we have enough experience for that. We have 20 now, exactly. I can just go down to the military experience training, but I want to get that construction stuff, uh, done first. In fact... These guys should be done now, actually. Yeah, he's about to finish. This guy is actually pretty good. 